know Batman's here. What's wrong, Jim? Come on, you're scaring me. It's Barbara. She's been taken. No, no, no. I spoke to her. She said she got out. She left hours ago. Stay calm. We'll get her back. Which one? Who's got my little girl? Scarecrow. They took her from the clock tower. All right, we need to go. There could be a clue, something that will lead us to her. I'll follow. Stay in contact. You've got to tell him it's your fault at some point, Bats. And the great thing is, I'll be standing right there when you do. Just get us there in one piece, Batman. We're running out of time. of the Arkham Knight's forces you requested. What have you got, Alfred? I've set the Bat Computer to analyze militia presence across the three islands and provide you with a real-time representation of the occupation's strength in each zone. As you can see, Miyagani Island is heavily occupied, with a substantial drone ground force controlling the roads. Founders Island is the militia stronghold, protected by long-range radars and a missile launcher. I'd recommend keeping the Batmobile away from there for the time being. The remaining drone forces on Bleak Island have been redeployed to protect the clock tower, so expect significant resistance. Thanks, Alfred. I'm heading there now. Colleen? Is that you again? Oh, don't pass out just yet. Come on, show a little spy. <laughs> Just wait till your father gets home. He's going to be furious about all this mess. You would have thought old Jim Gordon had been through enough. First, some handsome young maniac cripples his daughter. Now he's blaming himself for her being taken. You really should tell him this is your fault, Bats. I'm sure he'll understand. I mean, it's not like you went out and got his daughter killed. Well, not yet, anyway. The night's still young. Oh, God, no. This isn't your fault, Jim. Of course it is. Crane's done this to get to me. I should have been here. There's something I need to show you. We haven't got time. She's not like us. Jim. Stronger than you realize. She works for you? This is all your fault. I will find her. She's my family! My daughter! She's all I've got! I never should have trusted you. Never! on my own stay away from my family quite well considering of course I wouldn't have told him but that's why it's so liberating being me 
You've got a lot to look forward to, Bats. I need to find out what happened to Barbara. They covered their tracks by disabling the clock tower security cameras. If I hack the municipal CCTV system, I should be able to monitor all access points to the building. That's the Arkham Knight. He's got Barbara. I need to confirm which car he took her in. There. That's the vehicle they took Barbara away in. Those tires are Amertech D60s. I can program the Batmobile to track their unique tread pattern. It'll lead me right to them. Now that I think about it, how did Scarecrow know to go after your IT department? I mean, I had no idea she worked for you when I shot her. I just got lucky. Seriously, I was aiming for her head. Isn't that Barbara's job? Oh, right! In all the excitement, I almost forgot. <laughs> you don't really believe old Jimbo's gonna forgive you if you save her. He holds a grudge, Bats. I should know. Alfred, I've re-enabled the bridge controls. Marvelous. I'm rebooting the network now. Forget, Forget Scarecrow. It. It's time to face your one true nemesis, Never. Batman. Oh, dear. Is that who I think it is? Enigma. Contact me when you're ready with the bridge. Riddle me this. Why would a Batman visit an abandoned orphanage? Eddie, sweetie, you confuse me with Robin. The big guy and I aren't all that close. Oh, oh, I know. It's because of what will happen to his feline friend if he doesn't get here in time. Shocked, Dark Knight? Stunned? <laughs> you didn't expect this, did you? That is because you are no match for me, Edward Nigma, the Riddler, and your intellectual superior. Did you think I would just forget our last meeting, Dark Knight? You humiliated me. I know you will not beat me this time. It is utterly impossible. You cannot do it. I have won already. I will mock your attempts to solve my conundrums. I will stand triumphant over your bloody corpse. And as the dim light fades for good in your tiny dullard's mind, your final thought will be how I have bested you. Come to the orphanage, detective, or she dies. Riddler has Catwoman. Tell me why. I don't know anything, I swear. I just tied her up and left her inside. Why? What's Nigma's play? I ain't got a clue. I just brought it here and planted someone else's trophies nearby. That's it. You gotta believe me. I do. That had better be you. And you had better be sorry. Keep still. Are you okay? Perfect. What little girl doesn't dream of being bait for her strapping dark night? We're leaving. You might be, but I'm not. Ah, both contestants are finally here. Tonight, folks, we've got riddles galore. But first, let me introduce my beautiful assistants. Ah, I'm growing tired of my dependence upon the least useless dregs I can scrape from Gotham's utterly uninspired underbelly. underbelly. Why rely on others for help? feline has been fitted with a shiny new collar. With each challenge you complete, you'll get one little key. Collect every key and the kitty goes free. Remove it too soon and the kitty goes boom! <laughs> well, don't just stand there, Dark Knight. Take that rocket-fueled roadster of yours and make your way to the cauldron train yard. My first test is waiting. Waiting. I'll come back for you. Stay here. I'm wearing a bomb, Batman. Of course I'm staying here. Go get my keys. The car veered off an empty road. Looks like the driver wasn't wearing his seatbelt. Traces of pepper spray on the right side of the driver's face. 
Oracle must have been in the passenger seat and deliberately caused the crash. Clever. I should check the area where she was sitting. The door was torn off during the crash. The door must have been opened before the crash. Oracle got out. Oracle got free of the vehicle before the crash. for the Arkham Knight sidearm. The trajectory and impact velocity points to a shooter that matches his height. At this range, he couldn't have missed. A warning shot. Lucius, Oracle left me this scrambler device at the scene of the crash. Decrypt the data so I can pinpoint the Arkham Knight's location. Ah, this kind of thing was more Miss Gordon's specialty. I'll see what I can do, but it'll take me a little while. I'll meet you at Wayne Tower when you're ready. Alfred, give me an update on Gotham's most wanted. One moment, sir. Right, these two are just in. A mysterious hooded figure has been spotted on a rooftop in Grand Avenue. He appears to be standing beside a burning bat symbol, sir. It might be wise to establish whether this interloper is friend or foe. Reports are also coming in of a blaze at the Bristol fire station. One suspects arson, sir, as the power to the building has been cut, disabling the fire suppression system. You may wish to investigate. Nice of you to drop in, Mr. Wayne. I suppose you weren't really dressed for the front entrance. Have you finished the decryption? Fully decoded. I've downloaded all recent militia radio transmissions and their corresponding coordinates to your machine. Thanks, Lucius. I can scan the network for the Arkham Knight's voice print and determine the location of his last broadcast. Upload waveform for analysis. Now I've waited long enough. Batman dies. Tonight. Scanning communications for voice print match. Location verified. Got it. The night's transmitting from the Miyagani Tunnel Network. Glad to be of assistance, Mr. Wayne. But while you're here, we've been working on some further upgrades for your car. Let me know where you'd like us to focus our efforts. Ah, you'll like it. I'll be in touch as soon as it's ready. Now, if there's anything else you need, I'll be here all night. It's not like I could leave this city even if I wanted to. If I'd ever been curious about your identity, I would have torn off that mask years ago. I always figured the truth would be a letdown. But I have to admit, masquerading as Gotham's least interesting socialite is one hell of a cover story. The dead parents are just icing on the cake. Have you made any progress on the cure? Getting there. Hey, I haven't heard from Barbara for a while. Is she okay? She's fine. She's working on something for me. It's important. But she's safe, right? Don't worry, Tim. Just keep working on that cure. You're not going anywhere, old man. Try weave titanium coated armor plate. Nice. Unless you know exactly where to shoot. Satisfying when I kill you. Oh, and don't worry about Barbara. I'll take better care of her than you ever did. Uh, Batman's in the control room. Show him what happens when he messes with my
to know you very well now, does he? I think you're trapped down here. <laughs> what kind of super villain thinks a bullet to this? Stop it. Knight. Oh, you won't find him! You think I didn't know you were tracking my broadcast location? <laughs> Here's a lesson, Batman. I know how you think, which means I know how to beat you. Where is he? With Barbara Gordon. She's ours now. Can you imagine what the Knight's going to do to her? What are you doing? No! You can't do this! Where is he? He's gone to see the little man, the penguin. <laughs> he supplied the safe houses for the attack. The knight's gone to pay him for his services. That's it! That's all I know! No! Not again! Remember something else? He uses a refrigeration company as a front. The trucks distribute weapons throughout the city. What's it called? North! North Refrigeration! Thank you. Alfred. I need you to find out everything you can about North Refrigeration. Of course. But may I inquire why? Penguin's supplying arms to the Arkham Knight. And right now, he's the best lead we have to finding Barbara. I'll look into it right away, sir. Ah, I can see Mr. Fox is trying to contact you. Lucius. Mr. Wayne, your new Batmobile upgrade is ready to deploy. The Batwing is en route to Grand Avenue. Looking into North Refrigeration as you requested. It seems Master Grayson has been investigating them for some time. Good. Tell him to send me what he has. He insisted on seeing you in person, sir. He's on his way from Bloodhaven with the pertinent information. He'll meet you on a rooftop overlooking the Ranella Ferry Terminal. Thanks, Alfred. In the meantime, sir, scans have established that the Arkham Knight has mobilized his senior lieutenants in armored personnel carriers throughout the city. We currently have a lock on one such vehicle, should you wish to intervene and remove them from the battle. Still lurking around on rooftops. You shouldn't have come here. Not tonight. Look, are you kidding me? When I heard about Barb... North Refrigeration. Tell me what you know. Penguin's using freezer trucks to smuggle weapons out of Bloodhaven. Now, I think he's stockpiling arms right here in Gotham. The question is where. Cobblepot's the best lead we have on Barbara. I need to find that weapons cache. If I can intercept one of his trucks, it'll lead me right to him. Huh. If only you knew someone who's been tracking their movements. What? You didn't really think I'd come here without a plan, did you? I'll handle this. You're needed back in Bloodhaven. Come on, Bruce. Look, let me help. You can't do it all on your own. It's too dangerous. I won't risk losing anyone else. Bloodhaven needs you. All right. I can take a hint. But if you want to keep tabs on that truck, you're going to need this. It's a prototype straight out of R&D. The old fox has outdone himself this time. I'll see you around, Bruce. Now I just need to give them a little motivation to lead me back to their hideout. What did you forget?
I'll break every bone in your body, Cobblepot. They were going to see some geezer called Simon Stagg. I think he runs a pharmaceutical company or something. Do not lie to me. I'm not. I swear. They said he's about to leave Gotham. And those airships over the West River, it, it belonged to him. Put him down. We'll shoot, Bert. Won't do you any good. Scarecrow's gonna break you. You are going down, Batman. Hold him steady, boys. I've been working on my swing. Watch and learn. Gonna knock his head right out of the... This is you handling it, right? Now don't worry. You can thank me later. We're gonna put you in the ground. Let's see who can take out the most. to let me help I had it under control I told you I need you back in Bloodhaven no, Scarecrow these weapons this all affects Bloodhaven too the best place for me is here look with the amount of weapons Penguin has been running into Gotham this cannot be everything he must have other caches in the city search this place for evidence it should help us locate more of Penguin's refrigeration trucks what a wanker. Let's put him out of business, eh? <laughs> Please, what are you doing? Bat, come on. Don't lock me in here. I'll do anything. You want the laundry done? I'll do it. Help out, Alfred. You got it. I'm going after Barbara. I'll contact you as soon as I track down any of Penguin's trucks. Thanks, Dick. I appreciate it. What are friends for, Bruce? Ned? Of course, sir. Now, what have we got here? A good old-fashioned ambush. Oh, you wait there, Bats. Let your dear old Uncle Jay sort out these chumps. <laughs> What do you have on Simon Stagg? Now, let's see. The CEO of Stagg Enterprises, a company that specializes in advanced medical research and development. I'm heading to Stagg's airships now. Scarecrow was on his way there, and that's our only link to finding Barbara. The threat analysis indicates that Founders Island is covered by the militia's long-range radar and missile launchers. The Batmobile will be detected and targeted as soon as you cross the bridge. Don't worry, Alfred. I'll go in on foot and stick to the rooftops. Find me the schematics of those airships. Right away. Best of luck, sir. I'm at the airships. What did you find? Well, the ship's original schematics reveal a service hatch that should be accessible from the top of the aircraft. It would seem Mr. Stagg is rather protective of his research. I expect the security to be high. Thanks, Alfred. Lucius, how's the remote hacking device coming along? I think I'm about to need it. Maybe you should add clairvoyance to that job description, Mr. Wayne. I'm uploading the latest decryption software to the device in the vault at Wayne International Plaza. You can collect it from there. have got stag and from the look of him he won't last much longer i need to save him where are the files thank you they, they were going to kill me why what did you do nothing these animals came in and just started shooting they were collecting those cylinders nimbus generators a totally clean power cell technology we've been developing 
Where's Scarecrow? He's on the second airship. Did he have anyone with him? Oh, you, you mean Barbara Gordon? I think we both know she's probably dead, don't we, Bats? <laughs> identity of this so-called Arkham Knight. What have you found? Nothing, sir. None of the former Arkham City inmates who remain unaccounted for fit the Knight's profile. Widen the search. When Joker took over the asylum, dozens of inmates escaped. Focus on young men with military experience. Downloading the files now, sir. Apologies for the interruption, Mr. Wayne, but I can ready another upgrade for the car if you'd like to take your pick an incoming missile. Excellent choice, sir. Nothing like a short-range EMP blast to afford one a little breathing room. But don't worry, the Batmobile's immune. Use chemical expertise, but no. He's Alfred, Scarecrow Stag and Scarecrow were working together on a project code named Cloudburst. But if that's the case, sir, why is Scarecrow attacking Stag? Stag must have double-crossed him. He's here for the device. I'm giving you remote access to Stag's computer network. Search for anything related to the cloudburst. I need to know what it is. As you wish, sir. Good evening, Mr. Stag. Please let me go. I've got so much money, even Batman won't be able to stop us. But you couldn't stop yourself from betraying Scarecrow for a little more. I I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. No, you're not sorry yet. When Scarecrow's toxin starts pumping into this cell, I think you just might be. Oh, God, no. I've seen what that stuff does. Someone help me! You've got to get me out of here. They're insane! You lied to me. You've got one more chance, Stag. One. I, uh, I, uh, okay, okay. Look, uh, uh, Scarecrow came to me. He, uh, needed my help with the Cloudburst. What does it do? No, no, no! <laughs> Don't let them touch me! <laughs> the Cloudburst Stag. Tell me what it's for. I don't know. It's all over my skin. It's crawling all over my face. I should leave you to your nightmare. Okay, this is it. The moment we've both been waiting for. Scarecrow's just down there. So are you gonna stop him and save Oracle? Or am I going to get another hit of that delicious gas while you watch helpless as she dies? How do we decide? Up, roll up. It's the Pick the Real Scarecrow Show. So where's our first contestant? You, the one with the ears. Step up and have a go. What's your name, sir? Bruce? So, which one will it be, Bruce? Difficult, isn't it? <laughs> Is it the one on the left or the one on the right? <laughs> You're not dying. 
just feels like you are. My toxin is filling your lungs, drowning you in your greatest fears. What can you see? A city engulfed in fear. Betrayed by those you trust the most. Your darkest secrets revealed. As I tear your mind apart, Gotham will watch. I will cut that mask from your face, and the whole world will see the fear in your eyes. Then they too will understand. There is no savior. No more hope. No more Batman. Maybe it's already happened. to abandon your beliefs. Come on, finish him and him. Look at him. He's dead here better than the creep who killed your parents. You need to do something. You need to stop him. Good. <laughs> Good. Something's changed. You're different. I prefer to call it a work in progress, but it does show potential. You're trapped. There's nowhere to run. Who said anything about running? Scarecrow is broadcasting across Gotham. You need to see this. How does it feel to see your city on the brink of ruin? Your friends in the clutches of death? You stretched yourself too far this time, Batman. And now your failure is all but complete. As that final dying breath escapes her body, she will failed her. You know, Hugo Strange used to lecture us like scared. What? We hurry all the way here and Crane's killed her already? <laughs> He's got no sense of occasion. We both know fear is theatrics, Batman. So permit me the indulgence of putting on this show. Ooh. Maybe I got Bagface wrong. Oh, oh! Here comes the toxin. I can practically taste it. Wow, what's happening? Barbara! Yes, you see it now. The horror no. behind the glass. No. The monster that will be your end. Unless you pick up that gun and deny him. No. Don't listen! Barbara, it's me! Your friend! You won't get me! I won't let you get me! You will bring death to all who follow you. Sir, what? 
What's happened? She's gone, Alfred. What do you mean? Barbara. Scarecrow was punishing me. And he killed her. No. Oh, my. Well, sir, we need to focus. The people of Gotham need you. I should have protected her, Alfred. She's dead because of me. Sir, please listen. Stag's files have revealed what the Cloudburst does. It's a dispersal device. Sir, don't you see? Scarecrow has the means to engulf the entire city in fear toxin. You stopped him from making it operational, but it's only a matter of time. Sir, did you hear me? He heard you. He's wondering how he can live with himself. Master Bruce, don't let Miss Gordon's death... Don't let it be for nothing. Oh, you can't bring her back. Let Uncle Jay take charge. No more bad memories, no more pain, no more fear. Scout on him. Ivy. Oh, no. Sir. Alfred, run a satellite scan of the city. Let me know the instant you locate the cloudburst. Of course, Sam. Where are you going? GCPD. Ivy was immune to Scarecrow's toxin. You think she will help? She doesn't have a choice. What the hell happened on that airship? Scarecrow took the cloudburst. I'm guessing that's bad. Where's Gordon? He's still looking for Barb. I can't reach him. Tell me you found her, Batman. Cash. I'm sorry. No, don't say it. Not her. If Gordon comes back here, lock him up. He goes after Scarecrow. It only ends one way. I need your help. From where I'm standing, you need a miracle. Why didn't the gas affect you? You are scared. You would be too, if you knew what Scarecrow's planning. And I should trust you, why? Because without your help, every plant in this city will die. About that miracle. I created a spore to counter the effects of Crane's toxin. It's easy when you know how. And can manipulate plants on a molecular level. Could it protect the entire city? Theoretically. But there's no way I can produce enough on my own. Then let's get you some backup. Where to? The Botanical Gardens. They're the oldest plants in Gotham. They'll tell me what we need to do. Here, Ivy. What now? Look at her. She's been here since before man walked the earth. She still holds great power. But she's weak. Poisoned by decades of pollution. She won't be able to fight Scarecrow's toxin on her own. Then we need another. There aren't any left like her. Not anymore. What happened? What do you think? Man. You cut them back, built over them, stopped them from reaching the sun. If I can locate the roots, could you revive them? They're lost. Buried beneath this concrete monstrosity. How will you... The bigger the plant, the deeper the root. You wait here. I'll find a way to break them free. Lucius, I need a way to track an ancient root system. It's deep underground. I'm sure I can throw something together, but it may take me a little while. Come to Wayne Tower when you're ready. Thanks, Lucius. Alfred, 
Give me an update on Gotham's most wanted. Uh, let's see. Nightwing has been tracking another of Penguin's trucks. This will undoubtedly lead to another cache and a chance to rid the city of Cobblepot and his flood of weapons. We also have a robbery in progress at the Bank of Gotham in Chinatown. Surveillance footage confirms that the perpetrators are known associates of Two-Face. Perhaps Mr. Dent has misplaced his coin. Whatever his reason, he needs to be stopped. Thanks, Alfred. <laughs>